Awe masukunis. So today I'm going to be speaking about things I hate about going to the movies. So firstly, it's kak expensive. So of course everybody goes on a Tuesday. That's taking you go off price special. It's the best thing that happened to Cape Townians, I tell you. And you will only go to New Metro if your friend is paying or if you're going on a date. To do story. Speaking about that, there are still couples who go to the movies and then just get baimaka, dala each other real quick, suck each other's faces throughout the whole movie. Food Sheik, I'm not going to pay 60 rand to fray a mate amongst people in the darkness. Go do that cock at home. But Mark, it's romantic. Just, I can give you the time of your life at home, alone, in my sweatpants and hoodie, for free. Now that's romantic. And cheaper. And not to mention the aircon moves in the movie theater. Your balas will almost deviate right into your body, especially now in the winter. Okay, so you stand in a queue for like half an hour, get your movie ticket and your popcorn and coke that costs a fortune. You walk into the theater, down the stairs, and try to find your seat. Okay, E7. Vara focus E7. E7, E7. Vara E7 now. Das it. But oh, what do you know? A tiff is sitting in my seat. Permi happens to me. Then I must look like a tourist and say, Sorry sir, but um, this is, this is my seat. Thank you, thank you. And then another thief walks past and kicks my shins binister achter with his caterpillar boots. Little bitch can't count, little bitch can't see. Anyway, so there you sit down and you wait for 20 minutes worth of trailers and adverts to end. And you finish your popcorn while you're at it because popcorn is more expensive than petrol. So you must buy a small shirt. But the thieves in the cinema are clever because they bring their own food with them into the cinema. Chips. And cans of coke. Lord, help me now. And on the odd occasion, some smetif decides it's funny to fling their popcorn into the air and then it lands on my gefriet. Now why, Yere, why would you waste your popcorn that you had to pay 40 rand for to now fling it into another person's beak. Manita for you! Okay, so the movie finally starts and you get yell but excited only to find the tiff that's sitting behind you got comfortable and put his feet onto your chair like this. No, you don't do that if someone is sitting in front of you. You only do that after so 30 minutes where you see that someone's not going to sit in front of you then you can dial up. But don't put your feet on my seat. Fuchik. Also, there in front of the cinema, there's a group of tips that decides to comment on every single thing that happens in the movie. No, 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 don't go inside. Larry Tiff is going inside. Just watch now how she freaked. Just watch now how she balan out of this movie. This bitch is cut for some... Ah, see, see, I told you, I told you. Tiff. Oh yo, bacon, nala, kasam, amin, alhamdulillah. And in the other corner, you get a tiny, usually in her early 30s or late 20s, that laughs for every damn scene. But she laughs like a goat searching for water. <coughs> and bless her soul, because she brought her child also to the movies. A child that knows nothing. A child that is worse than Jon Snow on a good Day. Mommy, who's that? Mommy, what's happening? Mommy, is she dead? Mommy, I'm bored. Mommy, as a belief, control your offspring. And then, my absolute worst cell phones. Now, surely, we've been told thousands of times to switch off our phones by that mysterious man with a deep voice that says, kindly put your cell phones on airplay mode or put it on silent because the movie is about to start. But no, ach, nobody's gonna message me now. It's fine, I'm not gonna put it on silent, you know. Ooh, a WhatsAppy! Turn off your phone. You will it claim all wars or not? And also, don't you hate those people who have a bladder that's this small, this small, that need to get up and go pee, and then come back and then get up and go pee, and get a sit down, or just bring some a bucket that you can put next to so you can just pee there because I want to watch my movie without your big diff in my 
vision. If there is anything else you find disgustingly annoying about going to the movies, please drop a comment in the comment section below. And also make sure to check out the cards in the top right hand corner of the screen. Until next week, Owens, thank you and for check.